problem. Police and schools don't keep students safe. The United States has the highest incarceration rate in the world. And for Black young people and other young people of color, minor infractions within schools are highly criminalized. And funneling young people of color into the prison system through punitive disciplinary practices, commonly known as the school to prison pipeline. In many places around the U.S., continuously increasing funding for police departments is prioritized while public schools are continuously under-resourced. Solution. If schools truly want to set up all young people to lead safe and healthy lives, budgets need to align with values. Money being spent on police that create unsupportive learning environments should be redirected to support sexual health education that's honest and inclusive. School counselors well-versed in childhood trauma, lactation centers for young parents, and so many other tangible resources we know can improve the education, health, and well-being of young people. Action. We are the ones we have been waiting for. If you believe that schools need to divest from police and reinvest money into the health, well-being, and safety of young people, take action today. Visit advocatesforyouth.org forward slash divest to start a campaign to pressure schools in your local community to divest from police and invest in young people.